What's up YouTube, it's Daniel, back at it again, and if you guys have been watching my videos recently, yes, I'm wearing the same hat and the same clothes, I'm actually just banging out a bunch of videos today, because I'm trying to hit 12 by the end of the month, so hopefully I can do it, like I said earlier. I have been sick the past few days, so if my voice sounds a little, you know, rough, I apologize for that, but without further ado, in this video, I want to show you guys how to make easy thumbnails for your YouTube channel and this tool that I'm showing you can actually be used to make different images or different projects for you know a variety of needs so if we want to start off here first you can do custom dimensions but I like to say create a design and basically it just gives you all kinds of options I mean there's the YouTube thumbnail right here which we'll be doing there's also like blog titles, YouTube channel art, and all these different things, guys. Like, you know, if you want to make an ebook or anything, and it just kind of uh, and it just makes the size perfect for you. So, yeah, those. This is kind of just an overview of all the things you can make on here, and obviously you can do custom, like I said. But we'll go into the YouTube thumbnail first, and there's a lot of kind of and obviously there's a lot of different styles of thumbnail that people say work good or there's different you know types of thumbnails but it's kind of just up to you and you should be as creative as you want with them and a lot of people like to keep the themes kind of consistent so I recently have been doing like half screen videos so I'll do half of it with words on this half and then half with a picture so all of these you can just pick and use these these right or this right here is a uh, obviously a dollar sign so that means you have to pay for this one so some of these are um, paid some of them are free the free ones say free and obviously you don't have to use like the exact one but if you liked that picture or this kind of wording you could pick this and kind of edit it and make it your own but here's kind of an example of one that mine would look like so I have like a half and half and some words over here, you know, talks a little bit about what the video is and then a picture of myself and, you know, whatever's going on in the video. Something like that stands out, makes people want to click. So yeah, I mean, there's the possibilities are kind of endless here. And I guess we will just go with this one that we have right here. And I'll kind of just walk you guys through how I would make the thumbnail for this video. Actually, we'll make the thumbnail for this video. That sounds like a good plan. So, you know, up here, if this is how to create uh, YouTube thumbnails, you can do how to create thumbnails for YouTube. And we should probably resize this down to like 36 and we could center this and basically I mean it's just like I said it's up to you but the main value that you guys are probably getting from this that you didn't have before is Canva which is this tool so you just go to canva.com and make an account and you can just use your Facebook account to quickly sign up and then you'll just get into where I was, and you can use all the different things in here to create all kinds of different stuff. But, you know, a beginner's guide, we could leave that, honestly. And then just throw that there, and then just throw a picture of myself there. So, you know, I have some pictures here from previous videos. So if I just wanted to throw this in there, bam. In there, thumbnail done. That took me like three seconds. And then all you do is download up here download and it'll save it and it'll just download right to your if you're using Google Chrome it'll pop up right here you can just drag it on your desktop and you're good to go then you just drag it in your YouTube video and uh, put it in there as a custom thumbnail and some other stuff you guys can do is there's text over here there's different backgrounds there's different colors you know so if you guys want to do different color codes you can look up color codes for specific colors if you want and then there's all of these so there's free photos and you can kind of scroll through these find a good photo if you want or there's 
uh, frames. So these are basically just uh, pre-sized frames for images. So instead of me having to drag this photo in here and resize it, I actually just dragged it in there and you saw it kind of snap into place. That's because this is like a template, so it had one of these frames. And here's some more frames. And then there's all kinds of stuff. I mean, there's shapes, there's lines, there's like uh, drawings in here. So, you know, if you wanted to get a little like, if you were doing Instagram, you could find the Instagram logo right here. If you were doing, you know, something about money, there's all the different kinds, you know, I'd throw some money in here. You know what I mean? There's the, the possibilities are pretty much endless here. So I just thought this would be a good, good thing to show you. Since I know a lot of you are starting your YouTube channel or already have and uh, don't know how to make thumbnails. But yeah, so this is just a really quick video on how to do that. Like I said, there's all kinds of different stuff in here. I could make an in-depth video for you guys, but I really think it's just you know a matter of using it and finding the different things that you want. So again, it's just canva.com and you can just make something like this and even this is better than just having your you know, video be plain. So I highly encourage you guys to use thumbnails. I myself have seen much higher click through rates and watch times on videos that have thumbnails. So just a tip and I hope you guys enjoyed. Please leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.